we're just dropping down, we're in a deep hole here. Got some liveys, pretty basic system. Pat and Oscar rig. Oop, bit nervous. All we do is, you've got your bail arm open. Oh, the cameras are nervous too. We just got the bail arms open and we're just sitting here drifting over the hole. At the same time, Vic's reverse it up to try and hold us on the spot. Oh, and you can feel it. You're using the braid so you can feel the bait playing up and going brr, brr. Look at that mark up high there. Look at the, yeah. Oh. That's what we want. Drop that livey down. As you're doing it, you feel it thud, thud, thud. Give it a little bit of line. And you've got to do it. Look at that. And it doesn't matter what estuary you're fishing, and the whole key is fish those deeper holes, you know? That's where they sit. Use your tide changers. Sit on those. And when you catch them, always be really sort of mindful of where you are. Mark it on your GPS. You know, keep no oh, cams on there too. Double. Right. Got it. Double. Only the West Australian hasn't caught one yet. Down, yeah, don't make excuses. You know, and you just bring them up. And this is what it's all about. Look at that nice colour of silver. Got a bit of a wrap on another line. Only a little guy. Look at that. Vic can bring him in. Him in the gut, as usual. I can't even hook him in the mouth. How's that? Lift him up. Have a look at that. That's where you hook him when you're really good. Anyone can hook him in the mouth, but only Al can do that. Only Al can hook it. Oops, sorry, mate. I'll go around this side. And look at that. How good's that? Oops, sorry, mate. Go the other way now. Yeah, we might try and see if we can let him go. We'll just bring him in. See if we can get him to go. There we go. Come on, little man, kick, kick, kick. He's gone. He's gone. How good is that? Two minutes, fish the tides, get Vic to drive, make him useful, you know, and you get a double. And if you turn around now. Yeah. Beautiful little one. You could let him go too, eh? Too, eh? I think that looks Hates good for See, now hold him out like that. Let's lift that rod to your left, turn that rod to your left, that's it. Well, a few photos, we might let this guy go, see if he can swim away. Let's keep holding him there and see if we can get a bite off him. With the wind howling, it persevered and the bite just got hotter. Um, slide past one, I'm up guys. I'll just get us back on it. Just really important with this jury fishing that you keep yourself right on the mark. What we've got here is the current screaming still, still a couple of hours to the tide. So what we're trying to do is just keep on the mark. And because you've got the wind going one way, tide going another, I saw we sort of dropped off it very quick. So I'll just get us back on the mark. And once you hit the bottom, I just want you to wind it so it's tight. Just click it over, wind tight. So it's just touching the bottom, so if you drop the rod tip, it touches the bottom. And then have the bail arm open with your finger on the line. I'll just hold you guys on there. Oh, you can see the dewy come off the bottom and nail it too, eh? Look. Straight down. Do you think so? I reckon. Here we go. hold the rod. Okay. That's I'll have right. to wind it, Cam, if you need a hand. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Hey, we've got another one on. It's a double. Bigger one? Oh, it's a triple. There you go, and all the grief I get. Now have a look at this. We've got a triple. We've got a Cam and Tom special. And we've got Turkey. Well, actually, we could say Milo and Otis over here doing well. They might have better fish on, eh? They could be a little bit better. So I might even get the net out. Oh, yeah. yeah much better fish. Yeah, I'll go and grab him if you want. You want to grab him? Here we go. Now have a look at that. Grab this one in the gills. Now, look at the size of that. A ripper. So let's just pull that hook out and just. Ripper. That's the one. That's the one. 
And look at that. Have a look at that. Stewie's on over the back here. Yeah, it's the same size. And look at this. We got the double on over there. It's the same size. Bloody beautiful. Come on, Stu. You still got your Dewey on or what? You dropped it or is this a little one? I'll just put this one down here. Lovely fish. Now we should actually add in here that Stewie's been helping us out for many a DVD over the years. He runs the Fingal Bay Holiday Centre. And because we've been really nice to him, we're going to look after him and bring him a dewy. That's it, oh, under and over. That's it, put your rods, that's it. Beautiful. Don't go in gear, whatever Boom. you do, Al. No, no, um, I won't do it from here anyway. Oh, I got a dew there. Let me lift this one up over the back for you. Let's see if there's any better. Oh, it's a cod. There's another one, two more dews. Walk yours around. This way, let's spin him around. There you go. Have a look at that. Look at this, you got a prawn down his throat here, eh? Look at that. I mean, they reckon they're prawns down here. Have a look at that. There you go, Stu, you can hold your fish. Slip your hand in under there. Right. Like that. And turn him around. There you go, Tom. Yeah, How good is that? Lovely, mate. And that's three triple hookup. Look at that. Yeah, that's pretty rare. That's, that's pretty rare. rare. That's triple hookup on Jews. They're not bad fish, they're all four kilos no, or so. Yeah. Stu's is the smallest one. Ah, get out of it. I got the wrong rod, didn't I? Hey? Eh? <laughs> 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 Alright, we'll see you next time.